We can't have already gotten somebody killed, right? Like... Did we Hello, time? my friend. Welcome to the show. Is this the lady we that's... friends, aren't we? The one that's been looking for Silas? I've waited for you. I've waited. Yes. So I do hope our time together proves enlightening. There's no need to worry. I'm here to help you. Think of me as your guide into the unknown. It's exciting. Yes. And terrifying. But if you're brave enough, if you let me help you, I can help you. We can help each other. Oh boy. This is the card you found. E that's the one. The fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't we? Innocence and freedom. Or recklessness and risk taking. Spontaneity. Actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think. Think. And don't get burnt. This lady is creepy. I can show you more if you'd like me to. I don't know, I guess. This is what might come to pass. A possible future. A path yet unchosen. Look here, look here. She's like the guy in the other games. Like the narrator. What is he called? The curator. Okay, so somebody else is having car problems, a car fire. There are secrets okay. out there, you know. Secrets and lies. Paths to uncover on which I can shed light, if you let me. Help me help you. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Yikes. I don't know if I want her help, honestly. What are her intentions? I've never really known what to do with those little clues. Like, it shows you an outcome, but I have no idea how to avoid it. Chapter 1, Hackett's Quarry Forever. Now this is better. Forest in the daytime is acceptable. Forest at night is never acceptable. I see, I'm wondering if this is supposed to be some years in the future, maybe? Established in 1953. Love. See you later, kids. Jacob. Yeah, Hackett's quarry forever. <laughs> well, I don't know. It said June twenty second. I don't remember the you date. Know hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp. It's like a romance apocalypse. Um. Hmm. I mean, you never know. The universe has a kind of way of uh, working these things out. The universe? Yeah, like the uh, the cosmic space gods. Space gods. You heard me. Okay, spell it. It's nothing to spell. You know, we're cool. Oh, so cool. We are super cool. <gasps> so is she dumped she... her ass, huh? Oh. <laughs> is she from Until Dawn? Quit it. Hi, Emma. Hey. Okay, this is, oh. um, you've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be lime and grab the last couple of bags, will you? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. Okay, who am I? Jacob? Uh, let's grab that. Jake, bags, 
Focus. I thought I was grabbing the bags. Okay, lady. Um, bags. Where do they keep those? Isn't there a dead person in there? Who is this? Hey, what are you, uh, what are you listening to? Good to know. Yep. Sounds like he's listening to the news. Okay, so this wasn't where the bags go. Or where the bags are. What are we looking at? I guess we're looking at wherever I move the stick. Okay. Um. Jesus Christ. Hey. Hey, are you guys gonna help with the bags or what? Oh, um, you know, I was actually just working on fixing uh, the door. It's... Dylan, come it's on. It's broken. Dylan, please. I can't. It's, it's... I gotta get the last bags What's in there. Come wrong on. with this thing? It's just... Dylan, closing. please. Hey. Sorry, bro. <laughs> wow. Well, thanks, guys. Dipshit's bolted it? Really? Okay. So they... This is the last day of summer camp? Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. Yeah, okay. We know this. A clue. Seventy years on, okay. Are we going in the window? Whoa, look at the lake. Wow, this place is, like, Man. really nice. Who would want to leave a place like this? It's like a goddamn Bob Ross. Yeah. What a sap. Oh, in the window. Skill. Yeah. Very nice. What am I supposed to close the window or is that to go back out? I don't know. Ugh. Horror. I hate horror. You picked the wrong game, my friend. Um... Okay, nothing here. I, the way his head moves around when I'm, like, moving the stick is, like, like, wool. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Can I pick it up? No. What about that? Look at these slobs. Stuff all over the floor, dirty dishes. Uh, whoa, look at this fireplace. This place needs a serious overhaul. I mean, it's supposed to be rustic, right? Oh, oh okay. Jesus. Maybe... Maybe that's too rustic? Oh, um, hello. Is this Emma? Or wait... Definitely not, Emma. Okay, really, dude? Locking me out? Okay, in my defense, A, it was Dylan's idea, and two, it was really funny. Oh, yeah, right. Is that is that right? I don't write the rules, man. Okay, whatever. Look, are you gonna help me with the bags or what? Nah, I gotta stay here and wait for Mr. H to return our cell phone. Sorry. Jesus Christ. Okay, and why are the stairs blocked? Well, apparently it's to keep raccoons and other pesky varmints from ransacking the place. Mr. H's words, not mine. Oh! Boring! Okay. So we're not going up the stairs. Is that you, Dylan? I can only deal with one shit at a time, Jacob. <laughs> That's pretty hilarious. I have no idea what we're doing. 
Can't do anything there. Oh, it's really pitch black. I can't see. Oh. Wait. Was it just a dead end? I can't see. It's so dark. What is that? Foggy window or something? Uh, cute bear. Do we need to like unbolt the door maybe? I guess not. And the stairs here are blocked. I don't think that's going to do anything for Varmint though. I don't think Varmint used stairs. Blood Castle, Elliot Sparks, Slaughter by Sunrise, Jose Rodriguez. Somebody likes their horror. This is where we came from. Okay, there's got to be something going on in here. What's down this way? Oh, here we go. Cool, okay, now the front door works. What did that mean? What? What was the... Oh. Temperance, to be balanced, to consume in moderation, or to indulge in excess. Ex excess. Temperance, take it or leave it, but remember, sometimes with temperance comes deferred gratification. Hello? Hello. Oh. How did we get back outside? What? Why are we back outside? Was I done? I don't think I was done. Hey, could you go any slower, dude? Okay, now the front door's open. What? Why did it do that? It, like, kicked me out. That was so weird. Man, that's a bad place to get stuck. That's such a weird thing to say. Is that foreshadowing or something? What is this noise? And then we're going back out. Um, I didn't find any bags in there. She's probably going to be mad at me. Jacob, go upstairs. Jacob, get bag. Caitlin moves on with her goddamn life. The stairs were blocked, Caitlin. I swear that girl's from the first game. Okay. Um... Stairs. We can't go up these ones. Oh, hey, look. Bags and stairs. What do you know? We're back, Caitlin. Right. Got the bags. Great. All by yourself, huh? Yep. What do you know? You're going to have to get used to that. Oh, my God. You are so mean. <laughs> At least I'm honest. Oh, 
Okay, that here we go. That was pretty mean. Okay, you're not telling me the whole truth about you and Emma, are you, son? Mm, what about you? Oh, okay. So now I'm the one who's not telling the whole story, huh? <laughs> oh, well, this is the bait I just got to take, Jake. Oh. Oh, sorry, I just got so distracted about that rhyme. I forgot what we oh, were... Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, you, you were telling me how you totally have a thing for Ryan. Wait, are we talking about Ryan, the sailing instructor with the sexy brooding loner thing that totally doesn't do anything for me at all? Yeah, totally. Hmm. Uh... I don't know. I feel like this guy's playful. Oh, sexy, huh? How does that camp by far? Okay, sure. Uh, look, it was all settled by the girls in bunk seven, like second day of camp. It goes Ryan, me of course, then Dylan, Emma, Abby, okay, Nick, and then Mr. H. And... <sighs> okay, are you almost finished? Please. Yep, that's it. That's everyone. <laughs> so she really just dumped her ass, huh? I don't. Okay, her whole thing. Is like, how are we gonna make this work? Different schools, blah, blah, blah. My whole thing is like, you know, maybe long distance, blah, 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 blah. And she was just like, Jacob. She gave you the look, huh? Yeah, do not pass go. Man, she has got you wrapped all the way around that dainty little finger of hers. How does she do it? <laughs> She's mean. Maybe I like it, or it's just a fling. I feel like he likes okay, it. Okay, you know what? Maybe you're right. Maybe she does have like this superpower over me, but you know what? Maybe I like it. <laughs> oh, likes it. Check. Totally not in denial. Oh, Check. Okay. Wow, the um the fumes of, of jealousy are just stifling over here. Excuse me? I'm just saying, I guess some girls don't have what it takes to hang with the big dog. You're a real charmer, you know that? I mean, same for her, honestly. Maybe they're perfect together. Seize the moment or confident? I don't know. Look, I'm just saying, I don't know why you didn't make a move on Ryan. You should have seized the moment. <sighs> well, can't seize the moment that never happened. Yeah, well, you can't wait for it to come to you. You got to make the moment happen yourself. Oh, right. Chase the moment around all summer like a dog with two dicks until it dumps you on the last <laughs> day of camp. Okay. Not going to miss you, Caitlin. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, so She's are we sure that this old rust bucket's roadworthy? <laughs> we'll take a look. It better be. One more night in the great outdoors might actually kill me. Hey, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Well, I haven't killed you yet. And you're still pretty pathetic. Hey, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> She's pretty hilarious. I kind of like her. Uh, okay, so... um. Total hypothetical, but if I was like a huge asshole and I wanted to break down the van so we'd have to spend another night here, uh, what exactly would I need to do? Well, you'd probably break the fuel line or, I don't know, what? rip out the rotor arm. And yes, that would make you a total asshole. Okay, and what does a rotor arm look like again? It's like an arm that's all rotary. You know, it's under the little black dome with the leads poking out. Jake. You do realize that even if we somehow did get stuck out here, one more night with Emma wouldn't make a difference. Trust me, Chick's made up her mind. Yeah. Sure. Is the rotary arm thing missing? Out. Is he going to tell her? Oh, break. No, what? I don't know. I guess we'll steal the rotor arm. At least stealing the rotor arm, we still have a chance of leaving. Breaking the fuel line seems pretty permanent. Okay, all of a sudden, I don't like Jacob. Come on with me, buddy. I'll put you right back tomorrow. No harm, no foul. That's the thingy she's talking about? Up here, my dudes. Why do they look like they're up to something? Hey, Jacob. What? No, dude, please. D d d Go along. Oh, Nick! Oh, uh... <gasps> oh, come on, man! I'm so sorry, Jacob. <sighs> Rough. Hey, maybe uh, you should have put it in airplane mode. <laughs> wow. That was dumb. Also, though, I thought I was supposed to press up. 
What's up, man? Shut the fuck up. Oh, yeah, no, no doubt, no <laughs> doubt. That's probably <laughs> what's going to get us me. all killed. Your mom? Oh, yeah, to, uh, to tell her I say hi. <laughs> I'll pay to fix it as soon as we're back, man. Well, it's bricked. Crap. Oh, thank God. Huh, not a peep. Either got zero signal, everybody's already forgotten I exist. Meh. Nah. You know what, whatever, I can go one more day without a phone. Day? The drive's not that far. You know what I mean. Where's everybody else? Why, she caught why that one. That? Mm -hmm. Sometimes you know stuff I don't. Look, I don't, I don't even know how to respond to that. You say, Nick, you're way smarter than me, and you're a super hot stud who gets any cheeky ones. Okay, yeah, keep dreaming, Junior. Yikes. It's kind of weird. It always looks like they're looking just a little bit down from where they should be looking. Like they're looking at everybody's neck. It's kind of weird. Whoa, these black screens make me a little bit nervous. Oh, good. It's scared it's crashing. Wow, this place is pretty amazing. So are these our little dorms? Abigail. August 22nd? I don't understand these dates. Hey there, party bear. Status report? We are officially empty nesters. High five up top. Oh, too slow. Really? Oh boy. You're about to get your phone back, aren't you? Let's go collect our bags and away from this mosquito infested backwoods dump. Doors locked, bags inside. <sighs> Fuck me. Yep. Hey, well, I'm not understanding so these quick action things. Find someone with a key? Shape our destiny. And by shape our destiny, I mean shape our way through this crappy lock and grab our bags. Lock picking? Break in, obviously. We can't leave okay. the bags. Let's do it. We better not get into trouble. I won't tell if you won't tell. Mr. Hackett's gonna find out. So what? I'll just think it was a bear or something. Have you ever seen a bear in these woods? No. See, like, look at... They're not out there. She's looking at her shoulder. Fair point. All right, let's do this. On three. One. Two. Three! Ugh. Okay. All about the power of positive thinking. Why do I ever listen to you? Because I'm always right. Are you sure they're going to... Emma's think proud of you. Oh, my God, relax. It's not like we killed someone. All right, well, I'm just going to take another look around, make sure we didn't miss anything. Go nuts. Whoa, look at that cliff wall. That is so cool. Okay, um... Aw. This was little Izzy's. Weird, okay. I want to play a game! <laughs> Uh, leave the creepy toy, I think. Yeah, you can probably just stay here, you creepy little thing. Yeah. And yeah, no thanks on that one. That's how you get haunted. Freak show goes, what? Why would this place be in the news? Up in flames. A scrap from the local newspaper, the North Kill Gazette. It doesn't look recent. Something about a fire. Was it here at Hackett's Quarry? I still don't understand what these are. Okay. What is that? I can't believe I'm actually going to miss all those lumpy loose springs. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe it either. Nothing here. So that was it? All right. Look at the bird. I don't know why, but I feel like that's a bad omen. All right, sweet. 
Am I supposed to go back here? Maybe not. Okay, well, this is uh, probably a good spot for us to go ahead and pause. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you're enjoying this series. This game looks really cool. I can't wait to see what happens. Hopefully, uh, you know, we don't kill everybody. But we'll see. All right. See you in the next episode. Hey everyone, Brittany here with Desert Bee Games. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video and you'd like to help my channel grow, all you gotta do is hit the like and subscribe buttons below. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time for more.